officially on the last leg. It was a great night. <laughs> Yo, what's up, bros? What's happening? What's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. And more importantly, welcome back to another gig log. A wedding today. We are doing the hat trick ceremony cocktail and reception. We're also doing uh, dance floor lighting and we're doing photo booth. So it's a team of three today. We have myself, Christian, and Rosalind. Right now we are loading up the stuff. As you guys can see here, uh, by the way, I don't know if I mentioned it, but now we are on the second floor, so we have to take this lift down. The reason why we did that is because we combined our units to just get one unit. So that kind of sucks that now we're upstairs, but uh, not too big of a deal. We just have to take a lift down. See, everything fits in the lift. It's a pretty big lift. As you guys can see, we just need to get totems and uh, photo booth stuff. Let me show you guys where uh, we store the stuff now. By the way, look at this. This mess that I made, it's because I plasti dipped the photo booth. <laughs> so uh, this is it right here. This is where we keep everything. Ooh, ooh. Time to load it all up. As you guys can see, simple process. We just take the lift down. Everything fits in one trip. And uh, now we load it. Alright bros, here we are, we are here, we are at the Crystal Ballroom. There is a wall here because uh, they're getting married in here and then they're moving to another room. So this is going to be ceremony and then this is reception. As you can see, they got a divider wall here. So um, they're going to flip the room. Luckily for us, we don't have to do much in terms of the actual flipping. That's good. Thumbs up for that. Once ceremony is over, they're obviously going to break down this wall. It's going to be the big room that you guys have seen in uh, videos in the past. We've been here multiple times. Then people are going to move over into the cocktail room next door. And then we're going to uh, be in here practicing our intros and all that stuff. So uh, without further ado, let's do this because uh, we don't have much time. Early wedding today. Early wedding. Three o'clock start. Bros, here we are. We are setting up right back here, like I mentioned. So uh, let's not waste any time. We have very little time to waste because we also have photo booth today. So uh, let's get to it. All right, we're basically done in here. We just got to do uh, some wiring. So while we're doing that, we're gonna go set up ceremony. I'm actually really, really excited for our ceremony today because we're using uh, the new speaker thing. I mean, the new, uh, the new microphone thing. So we just set up the ceremony. It's a nice and simple setup. As you guys can see, we have one speaker here. We have uh, my new mic rack here. This is where the computer will rest, so it gives it a nice bit of height. This is my little Yamaha mixer that I use. Two channels for the microphones, and then we have a channel for the computer. All we gotta do is flip this on. Everything should start powering on. We'll synchronize our microphones. Always, always, always make sure that you scan your microphones at every event. Don't just assume that what you scanned last time is going to work. The way this one works is you just press menu, enter, and it's scanning right now. Menu, enter, scanning right now. There you have it, now we sync them. Turn the microphone on. What I do is I line up this red with that red. Good. One, two, check. Testing. One, two. One, two, check. Test, test. One, two. One, two, check. Seems to be working. Back at it at the main room. As you guys can see, we are making progress. Everything is uh, it's going okay. Uh, we just got to do a bit of cleanup. As you guys can see, we're missing one speaker. That's because we're repurposing the ceremony speaker. Once ceremony is over, we're going to grab that speaker, put it on here, and then our monitor is going to be in cocktail. And when cocktail is over, we'll grab that and we'll use that as a monitor slash backup speaker. So redundancy is good, just in case the speaker goes down. <laughs> finished programming the lights we are all set and ready to go up lights were giving us a bit of issue uh, I think there was a lot of interference so they were doing a bit of flickering but uh, we just had to change the RC channel and that seems to have fixed the problem as far as our setup this is what it looks like we have the ADJ event facade we have the totems by the way today we're going with this new look wrinkly kind of look 
Uh, I don't know how I feel about it just yet. Let me know your questions, comments, or concerns. Um, we're using two scrims as opposed to one, and it gives you that real wrinkly look. Um, another thing that I want to start doing is I want to start implementing an up light right in front of the totems. This is a black one, so I need to get a white one. I need to get a pearl version so that it looks a little bit cleaner. So we'll have a whole pearl uh, look going up. So I'm going to order two pearl lights for the totems. We have the ape sticks back out today. I was able to fix them. The reason why we haven't been using them is because they were causing some issues. So uh, I was able to finally fix them and now it seems like they are working. Behind here, usual stuff. We did a tape job, of course. We have our console. We have a backup computer and then we have a bunch of storage underneath. Over there we have the photo booth, which uh, we actually just plasti dipped and now it's uh, our black photo booth. I think it looks a lot better in black than it did in white. Um, the only problem with the black is is that uh, it seems that it chips pretty easy, but uh, I think it looks a lot better. As soon as we fill up the room, everything will move into place and that'll do it. Friends and family, good evening and welcome to our celebration. At this time, we're kind of going to ask that you make your way to your seats. If you have a cellular device, at this time, we're kind of going to ask that you put it on the mute or airplane mode position for the duration of our ceremony. Good evening and welcome. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you still married. <laughs> you may now kiss. Go. Everything is all set up. Cocktail just ended. As you can see, guests are arriving right behind me. We have the monogram projector once more, as you can see over there. Massive dance floor. We're going to try to make the best of it. I hope that there's enough people to cover this dance floor. It's pretty big. And with that being said, that's pretty much it. Here we go. Let's do this. All right, ladies and gentlemen, good evening and welcome to our celebration this evening. To that, of course, in celebration of Lisa and Terry's wedding. Let me hear you make some noise. I need you guys to help me welcome with a big round of applause our very proud parents this evening, Patty and Dennis Sloan. Very proud parents this evening. Now please welcome our honored attendants this evening. We're going to kick things off with Erica and Steven. to keep it going, keep it real upbeat, Gilbert and Anna. Oh, I can feel it. It's going to be a party tonight. I can feel it. Make some noise for Alex and Veronica. Hey. And last but not least, make some noise for Morgan and Tori. Party people, I need you guys to do me a favor. One more time, I need you guys to scream. I need you guys to shout. I need you guys to make as much noise as you can. It gives me great pleasure to introduce to you your happy couple, Lisa and Terry. These two are going to share a very special first dance together to a song entitled Yellow. One more time, ladies and gentlemen, how about a big round of applause? Beautiful, beautiful. Friends and family, we invite you to take a seat, sit back and relax. The service will be around to take your dinner order, so we ask that you follow your seated for a couple of minutes. All right, bros, we just got through entrances. Everything went absolutely fine, absolutely great. Every time I do same-sex weddings, it's a little bit tough because I have to adjust. Can't say the words bride and groom. Makes things a little bit tough, but nothing that we couldn't handle. Made it through it. Didn't do any F-ups, so uh, thumbs up for that. Right now, servers are taking dinner orders, and in just a little bit, we're officially going to open up our dance floor for the first dance of the night, followed by toast, dinner, dance set, cake, last dance set and then we're done so uh should be pretty straightforward day we should be done Oh, 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 oh,
guys. We're here with Lisa and Terry. They just uh, celebrated their wedding. Yeah. Uh, they're already married, but uh, thank you guys so much for having it. How was it? Yeah. It was really great. <laughs> DJ Bar and Bar Entertainment kept the party going. We had a wonderful time and everything ran totally smoothly. Thank you so much. Everybody was getting up the whole time because you were just pumping them up. They didn't feel <laughs> disgenuine anywhere. It was amazing. We had the best time with DJ Bar Entertainment. <laughs> Awesome. Thank you guys. Thank yes. you so much. I appreciate yes. it. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What's, what's next? You guys going on vacation or what? Um, yeah. Woo! We're officially on the last leg. It was a great night. Oh, 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 oh. oh, no. oh I caught it. Saved it. Oh, my God. Woo! Did you see oh, that? Yeah. You put him sideways, Christian. That was so dangerous. I think I caught that on film. <laughs> <sighs> All right, bros. Uh, that officially does it for this video. We uh, we're almost done. We're packing it up, packing it up, packing it up. It was uh, it was a great, 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 great night. Couple was very nice. The crowd was super, super, super easy to work with. Everything was pretty straightforward. So nothing, nothing, uh, nothing was too great. Just the timeline was a little bit effed up. Dinner ran way longer than it should have had. I think we could have had way more dancing time. But besides that, everything went well. Everything went fine. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, be sure to leave them down in the comments below. Also, if you're interested in the stand that we used to project the monogram today, uh, the little projector mount thing, yeah, I'm gonna leave a link down below to my friends over at Colorado Sound and Light. Check them out. Uh, they're the ones who sent that to me and I've been using it ever since. Using those gobos is a lot easier than having the gobos sent out to be made. This is way simpler, way easier. Um, Ape Sticks did give us some trouble today. They died like two hours in, I wouldn't say. So that wasn't cool. One of my speakers was rattling, so I have to check that out. I'm fingers are crossed that nothing bad happened to it. But if you want to find out what happened, uh, you gotta subscribe. Like this video. Ugh. Like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to find out if my speaker is blown out. Uh, I don't think it's blown out, but it was rattling. I'm not sure what it is. I think it's Christian slamming it too hard. And if you really want to help us out, don't forget to turn on that bell so that you can be notified next time we do another gig. Long. Woo! Sign it off. You're going home at DJ Bar. Peace.